Hey everybody, welcome back. So today I'm going to be talking about the elusive wardrobe basic being the white button down. Or is it button up? I need to look that up. Somebody tell me down below. Button up, button down, what's the difference? Apparently it has something to do with the collar, I don't know. So today I'm going to be doing the first out of a series of videos that I have planned for my channel and that is styling one item multiple different ways. I think within my capsule wardrobe and decluttering and minimalism and debt-free journey, I'm really starting to see the value in taking your clothes a little bit further and styling them in multiple different ways. I think when you really play to the versatility of an item, you can really stay inspired, stay feeling good about your outfit, stay feeling chic and cool and hot. Hot. All of those things. Um, without having to go out and go shopping and buy something new every single time. And I hope these videos give you guys a little bit of inspiration that way too. I'd say one of my like problem items in the past has been searching for the perfect. And in my case, the perfect was a perfect white button up. By searching for that perfect item, I ended up with 10 or 20 different white button ups in my wardrobe. I have since pared that down, but one thing I realized I was missing was a summer version of a white button up, a t-shirt version, something that's a little more breezy, more cool. So that's where today's sponsor comes in. It's Power of My People. And today I'm going to be showing you how to style this shirt. It's like super casual, kind of cool menswear, very my style, but I'm gonna show you how to style this shirt in about 20 different ways for the summertime. Let's get into it. This shirt is called The Friend in the Wayward Fit. It's a very sort of oversized menswear style, very up my alley in my wheelhouse, very sort of structured, relaxed, and oversized. It's made of 100% linen. Everything is made in Canada, and I'm wearing an extra small. If you want that oversized, boxy, very relaxed fit, then I would say go to your true size. But if you want a little bit more of a contoured, defined, tapered look, then I would size down one size. Power of My People does have very inclusive sizing ranges, so they go everywhere from extra, extra small to 3XL. I'd say it is a little bit more on the sheer side, and it's a very sort of structured linen that you can really see the detailing in the fabric. I've chosen to wear a nude bra with it, and there's no problem. The fact that there's two very deep front pockets sort of even covers everything up, so I would be comfortable wearing this without a bra. The top has a little bit of a drop shoulder, and you can roll up the sleeves to adjust it the way you'd like. The fabric is very flowy and breathable and it's not cut the same length all the way around so it has this really nice sort of detailing on the side if you want to wear it fully open so that way it avoids getting overly bunchy when you tuck it in. It's recommended that this top is washed cold and hang to dry and they did provide me with a code right here or you can click the link in the description to save a little bit of cash if you are interested in making the investment for a really versatile basic in your wardrobe. So let's get into the lookbook.
that's it for today's video, you guys. Thank you again to Power of My People for sponsoring this video. I hope it gave you a bunch of inspiration and outfit ideas for your next whatever you need to do because some of us are in quarantine, some of us are in other phases. I think I proved to myself that having a really good basic in your wardrobe and just really playing around with it and putting it together and taking the time to put it together with a lot of different pieces in your wardrobe can really sort of change the look and change your perception of what a certain piece can offer you in your wardrobe. You really don't need to limit one piece to wearing it one way. I think the whole point is to try to have pieces in your wardrobe that can take you really far and still make you feel great any way you wear it. If you are interested in any of the pieces worn in this video, I will leave all that link down below for you guys, but do make sure to shop your closet first. If you like this video and wanna see more, please give me a thumbs up. It really helps me out. Not one of these, one of these, okay? And don't forget to hit subscribe. I would love to see you back. Thanks so much for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.